Hey, I'm Ricky Bobby. Big Red, America's number one cinnamon gum. If you don't chew this shit, you got something wrong with your head. You can see where the moon is like in the sun though in the camera. That's pretty neat. Well, look where it's at. I mean, it's like... Let me see it with that thing. This guy has a history of jumping on top of me when I'm around. I guess this is kind of like a first studio. This is Studio 46. This is cool. Goodnotestore.com. We got some bangers on the website right now. Floyd Connor fight. What do you guys oh, think? Oh man. I, that was lit. It was, I think it was a good fight. Exactly what happened was exactly what I thought was going to happen. He got outboxed. McG McGregor just got outboxed. I think he put on a good show. Gas too early. Jersey. He just shit. That's what he thought about the fight. He thought it was shit. <laughs> I hate how Connor fought like this. Yeah, he refused to put his hands up and he kind of did the it MMA. Made me nervous. Just kept his hand out there, you know, feeling him. Yeah. Like just kind of feeling at his nose a little bit. And, All right. All right. We got a Japan, what is this called? I don't know exactly what it's called, but it's a Japan crate. There's a bunch of Japan lettering on it, but essentially there's Japan candy, a drink, I guess. I think he said he heard a drink in there. Yeah. So I don't, I don't know what this kind of, is. Kind of like a monthly subscription box like you get. I mean, I know there's others out there, like Loot Crate, and if you're, anybody's familiar with that, not a plug. I want Slam Crate. But or, it's just ran, mm -hmm. random things in a box every month. You get to open it up, and it's kind of a mystery. But this one's got, like different candies from Japan and it's got a drink in it. It says it's got a do-it-yourself kit in there. I wonder what that's all about, but... All right, here we go on the initial opening of the box. Oh, Holy wow! Sh it's colorful. It's got a lot of different colors and all kinds of different random stuff. What's that out there? What we got there? What's, this first What's the first item coming out of the box? It's child-proof. Dang dangle it up and it's child-proof. Like a type of a coin purse type of deal. My coin Kid purse. Kitty coin purse, okay. That's cute. This is a booklet of stuff to do in Japan. Food in Japan is kind of like a explore more of Japan. Kind of like a brochure of Japan. Oh, I see. It's like a list of all the oh, different items we got in the box. So it what's shows the, everything we got. So this, the first item was a bonus item. What does it say here? Uh, Chakun mini pouch. Chakun mini pouch. I'll be using that for sure. It's like a little coin pouch. I don't know. I think we, it's kind of like a. Uh, Oh, 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 Jersey down, Jersey down. The paper was too much for him to hold. You all right, bud? You okay, Jersey? All right, anyways, wow, that was, that was dramatic. What's up, okay. Jersey? So, coming off the top here, we've got this little candy. And everything's in J Japanese, so you can't really read it. I guess there's a little bit of English back here. birds invading my private bubble. This simply says starch crackers. I don't know, they look kind of like... Oh, just Beaver. crackers simply here. Let's open up the book. This one's not in here. Oh, Jersey, Jersey wants it. He's getting first grabs. Yeah, he gets first dibs. Six and a half hours later. What's in it? I think it's just like a cracker. All it says starch cracker. I don't know. Can't huh. see that. It's kind of like an animal cracker. No way they can see that. I don't know. Yeah, they're just little tiny little. Cracker things. Huh? Actually, it's got a little sweet taste at the end. Mm -hmm. That's pretty good. Nice. Give him one. <laughs> yeah, move it now. Oh, we got it. Like it? Those yeah, are, those, are, those are actually pretty dude, decent. Yeah. Yeah, those are bomb. Not sure where they were. But it's got a cute little yellow puppy on the front riding a scooter. That's lit. New Sinking Ichigo Hard Candy. candy. See, he's a good bird. All right. Anyways, these are the new, new Sinking Ichigo Hard Candy. Quing Long Zhu, the Cadillacs of prune candy. I'm not good with Japanese pronunciations. I recognize the word Ichigo because I like the anime Bleach. If you haven't seen that, check it out. It's pretty cool. But it says it promotes good digestion. I think that means something like you're gonna poop better. So here we go. Um, what? Ow! What is this? It's a heart candy. Oh yeah. It's kind of hard. I think maybe it's one you got stuck on. You're not supposed to like immediately bite it. That's what she said. <laughs> Too bad. Immediately bit into it. 
Now I'm chewing on my teeth. That's not the candy you hear. That's my Japan, teeth. another banger. Yeah, that one's really good. Wow. Oh, he's going deep. The boy. Mm. Hello Kitty. Chocolate flavored wafer cookie thing magic. Alright. <laughs> he's trying to eat the paint. <laughs> Did you eat a lot of paint chips when you were a kid? <laughs> Why? Try one of these. These things are really good. I already don't know what these are like. No, don't do that! No, don't, don't, don't. Come no. on. No, that's not good for a bird. That was in my mouth. Alright, here we go. Hello Kitty Sticks. Oh, decent. I don't really like these ones. Nothing like a cracker stick. It's kind of round. It's got a hole in the middle. You could probably use a straw. I mean, imagine these are just like simple sour apple gummies. I don't know. Do you want to try one of those? Or... I imagine we already. We might as well try everything in here. Oh, yeah. Weak sauce. It's not really that sour. It's got a good apple flavor, huh? Mm -hmm. You're going to fall off the table, bro. And now, the cat's on the other side of the camera, kind of spying on the bird. The cat kind of looks like a tiger waiting to pounce. He knows wolf. And the Fuck bird is up. the bird is the cat's prey, obviously. So I think it's the other way around, dude. He was sitting there minding his own business, and Jersey walked up to him like initiating a fight. Like this bird wants to scrap. Little does he know that these animals. Yeah, but I think the bird's like probably probably like Conor McGregor, where he's gonna bite off a little bit more than he can chew. You know, he's gonna bite off more than he can chew. Do somewhat all right, but get his ass whipped. Yeah. I mean. This is new territory for him. The cat's been boxing for years. Show Naricho soft cider. This is unusual. It looks like soap. Yeah, it kind of looks like foamy soap or like cream. It looks like shaving cream. Yeah. It's got a potent kind of smell to it too. Kind of smells like shaving cream also. They give you like a dinky little spoon. But here we go. I'm gonna. Make an ice cream cone. Seems like a lot of work for a snack. For a snack you know yeah. what I mean? A little cheers there. Wow. Mm -mm. That is a big no. Mm -mm. I don't even know. It kind of tastes like shaving cream too. Try it, Drew. What do you think? Yeah, he's not sure about it, no. Let's get this out of here. So it creates Oh, like he this, went back for more. It creates like this little soupy concoction that is not... He liked it. Oh, these were the ones I was worried about. The this colored says, the peas. It says to Tohato Mama Soupy Chips. Apparently, there's a pretty un irresistible... Force meeting it's the like immovable a, object. Ooh, I don't want to eat this. Yeah, we're going to eat it. Yeah, go ahead and try it. It's like a little. I think this is Japan's version of a Cheeto, maybe. Yeah. Mmm. Yeah. Not as not as bad as I thought it was going to be, but awful. Back to the back to the Japan crate. Here we go. That's not that one. There it is. This is a. Sano Manma, Sano Mana Grip Fizzin Gum. This is a fun candy to try with a friend. Oh, how convenient. I have a friend right here. And, and tigers and lions, uh, uh, animals. <laughs> alright, alright, anyways, this is a. He's dancing over here. Two out it's of the free. three juicy grip gumballs are sweet. However, oh, Rudy. here we go, dude. Two of them, there's three in here. Two of them are sweet and one of them is sour. Oh. You won't be able to tell until you take a bite. Two of them will kill you and one of them won't. So, there's chances are. I want all three. Sour. That's good. Eh. I'm not a fan of the flavor. Mine's not sour, but it's got potent flavor. Mm. Super grape. You give me gum. Should have saved that for last. Oh, no, I did not think that. <laughs> <laughs> I 
The bird just pooped there. <laughs> okay, I actually need to do it now. It looks like bacon. <laughs> yeah, it's like, it's like a little strip. I think it's supposed to be like sour and cola flavored. It smells like fireball. It's actually not bad. It kind of has like a cola flavor to it. No, I like that. Mm-hmm. It's like black licorice, but not as gross as black licorice. Long, long sour cola. Nah. It's, it's like a sponge. Mm -hmm. It's typical gummy candy, I guess. Oh. Poopy pants. <laughs> you threw them on the floor. <laughs> Ace is going to eat one and then decide that he doesn't want them ever again. Okay, so the, there is. the Kasugai flavored gummies are decent. Feel good about enjoying these grapefruit and orange hard candies. So these are hard candies. Born in grapefruit. Every time you say hard candy, I'm gonna put in that clip from Todd Dagg Nights where he goes, prune candy. Dragon foot, bamboo pole, little mouse, Chinese boy, prune candy. Throwing Eating it. the Japan crepe rather than the contents of the crepe, he likes the crepe <laughs> itself. Hey, hey don't, 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 don't eat yeah, that. No, no okay. paper. Okay, here. There's the limit. You can only eat so much. Uh -huh. Ooh. Yep, it's just a hard candy. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. Thousand years later. A M E. In Japan, I think they say that like Ame or Ame or something. I'm not Japanese, I don't know. Nodo Ame. Only half Japanese. Waist down. The silly version of the classic wing pop is sure to send you in a fit of giggles. Oh, so this is what they high? I guess. <laughs> it sends you into a fit of giggles, so that's pretty crazy. That's interesting. It's like this little. Wobbly candy. It says you put it on your finger. It's a sex toy. Uh, so you kind of twist it on there. And you got a little ring pop. What do you think, Jersey? Nah, he don't really care. So this, we're, we've been trying to share this whole box, but this one I'm not really up for sharing that with you, man. That'd be a little f***ing weird. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you want to try it or? Is it just one? Yeah, it's just the one. Go for it. If it gets you high. I still got this. I don't do drugs. Do you feel giggly yet, bro? Is it kicking in? <laughs> Many months later. <laughs> it works, bro. Whoa, so that was the Baroron Pop, the Giggle Pop, the Ring Finger Ass Beat. That is called a mini bottle. Looks a like a tampon. Oh. What's it taste like? Yeah. I like Pixie Stew. Holy crap, that's like gigantic like sugar crystals. Pixie stick, only a little bit bigger. Oh, it kind of, they're like little crystally things that just kind of melt in your mouth. Like, yeah, exactly like a pixie stick. Yobo, I wonder, it's Y O B O. You only bang once. <laughs> Smash. Smash. What is this? So, this is the opposite of this. I just noticed that. You get these Hello Kitty wafer cookies and these Hello Kitty Yobos. Are basically like. <laughs> Everyone's favorite Japanese soda is back. Ramyun. This time we're introducing bubblegum flavor. So this is bubblegum ramyun or ramune or ra. Ramyun. Prune candy. You put that on there and you go like. Pow! Pow! Oh, there we go. Wow! So that marble just kind of drops to the bottom of the bottle. Go ahead, have yourself a drink. They are pretty good. I'm, I've always thought they were pretty good. It's different. It's like cotton candy in a drink. Chakun mini pouch. I'm gonna say that one of my. I have daughters. One of my daughters will probably appreciate that. And, and if I have any daughters, reach out to me. I'd like to get to know you. Wait, should we bring out the thing that I'm most hyped about? I think it's time to bring out the thing that you're most hyped about. Alright! They make sure 
You ain't booty. Lucky it's charms. Luck, yeah, it's lucky charms. It's lucky charms. It's lucky charms with okay, marshmallows. What's the that, different that's marshmallows? That. Like a crown. Oh, a booty crown. That's what this one's called. We got a booty crown. This one's a. D <laughs> that's a d for sure. No, that's unicorn horns, dude. That's a this is not for children. This is not for children. You want a fucking dick marshmallow jersey? Yeah, you do. It's actually not bad. I mean, put some milk in it. Wow. Hold that. Hold this. We really just got this stuff for me because I'm a wrestling mark. Oh. Wrestling candy bar. One Seth Rollins, one's AJ Styles. Oh, I guarantee it's, it's like a Hershey bar just with AJ Styles' face on it. So it's like $5 extra just because it has some wrestler's name on it. Some wrestler? Some. I said some wrestler. <laughs> You're supposed to sell that. Yeah. Well, it's a little late. WWE, give me a loot grape. Sponsor me. Bootios. Um, not a kid's cereal. <laughs> I never really got that gimmick. The architect. I don't understand any gimmick. Undertaker's a dead guy, and he's been the most over guy in the past like 25 yeah. years. <laughs> Say hello. There we go. Good job. You good, bro? He's shaking, man. Why is he scared? The Superman standing Step next up. to him. Step up. Or not? Ha <laughs> ha. I'm funny. <laughs> <laughs>